told you. I already told you it wasn't me, man. Man, come on. I told you like like 20 times. Uh, I don't even I don't even know you. Bro. Listen to this crap anymore. Two hours. Think it'll clear up soon? What am I, the traffic man? Supposed to have been at the pen an hour ago. I'm gonna get written up for this. Well, relax. What's your problem, your man? Fault? What the hell, man? What? You know. Cut it out. Jesus, you guys. You gonna make me? Yeah. Hey, Vince! Justin's gonna make me. It's too hot for this shit. Fitz, I'm making him hot now. Yeah, Danny, you're making me hot. Settle down, assholes. He started it. Hey, man, how about you open a fucking window? It's a prison bus, asshole. The windows hey, don't Hey, Justin, see that right, guy man. in the beat-up truck? Right. I'll bet Shut he lives in that there. truck now. You probably got his whole house. Life savings. Shit, I bet you stole his dog. You steal his dog, man? I wasn't stealing from guys like that. Anyway, better than stealing his virginity. Hey, how many times I gotta tell you? Here we go. Seriously, I was falsely accused. How old was she, 15? Damn it, it ain't like that. You telling me there wasn't a star witness waiting around in your white van? I'm shocked. We're all in the same boat here. What's the point of arguing? The point is, I'm not like that. My lawyer's gonna be here. Tell you about what, this. guys, I ain't afraid to say it. I'm hears about really this. missing my girlfriend right now. I'm oh, guessing she's pretty pissed nerve, at you. Man. It's I worse than that, man. She won't talk to me. Mouth. Haven't heard her voice in months. She's really messing with me, like for real. Just let it go, man. I want to, but you know, I love her, man. You should call her up when we get there. You gotta face that shit. You know, you're right, man. First call I get. Danny, I know you don't realize this because you're you, but you probably ruined that poor girl's life, you piece of shit. Big talk from White Collar back there. How many lives you wrecked, kid? Who cares? Hotter than hell up in here. I'm getting dehydrated. Hey, how about some water back here? Shut I up thought you back took the there. stand and cried your eyes out. I ain't telling you again. Didn't you lose your shit and tell them you didn't know what you were up. doing? Oh, I'll set you I up. lied. Turns out I'm good at that. You lied on the stand? See, that's the kind of shit I could never do. Religious? No, nah, man. Watch a lot of cop shows? Nope. What then? It just ain't right. It's a tough call. Why do more time than you need to? Gotta stay clean, man. Says the criminal. You wanna know the funny thing? I don't regret any of it. I carried my victims for years. They knew what they were getting into. And now here I am, and there they are. And Wall Street assholes pulling the same scores are smiling on TV. Fuck that. How did it all work, anyway? It was like, uh, a pyramid scheme. Aren't those kind of shit? It was a really good pyramid scheme. Hey, if nobody got hurt, no harm done. They'll get their money back. Most of it. How much did you make off with, anyway? Enough. So, like, a couple hundred K? A little over a hundred million. God damn, boy. Oh, when we get out of here, you, me, and Vince, we gotta go into business, know what I'm saying? You know, I don't actually know a thing about you, Vince. Maybe he's a priest. Yeah, Father Vincent. I bet he touched a kid. Two kids. You touch a couple kids, Vince? I helped my little brother. They send you to prison for that now? He was in trouble. I had to 
help him out. I knew it was something stupid. You regret it, man? If you're saying what I think you are, I got respect for you. But that's a hard thing to carry, you know? I don't regret it at all. Sometimes, you gotta do the hard thing. Yeah, I know what you mean. How'd they get you? Threw the gun in the trash. And? Some stupid dog knocked the can over the next day. Kid found it and turned it in. You gotta be kidding me. Man, you're bad luck, Vince. Bad luck, Vince! <laughs> that's not bad. What do you think, Justin? What the fuck are you gonna do about fuck you. it? Fuck you! Fuck me? <laughs> fuck you, motherfucker! Oh shit! Oh, man. Christ! What the hell is going on, Grab man? Crabtree, yeah. knock it off! Yeah. Yeah. Hey, get in there, man! Got? Hey, let him go, man! Hey, Damn it, Crabtree! Don't make me come back there He's now. gonna kill him, Vince! Let the guard handle it, guys. Fuck that! We gotta get in there! You do not want to get in the middle of that shit, Danny. Vince, we gotta do something. You know this ain't right. I'm not doing any more time to save some stupid ass. Where's your empathy, man? Where's your Jesus common fucking sense? Man. You can't do anything with these damn chains on. Shit! Crabtree, I'm warning you one you last time, you gotta get you in there. Get yourself in there and wake that shit up, on, man. man. Come on, boy, get back there. Okay, asshole, let him go. Get in between them, goddammit. He's gonna kill that boy. <gasps> Knock him let out. Let go, goddammit. Fuck. Jesus. What happened? What did you do, boy? God damn it, boy. Answer damn. me back that there. That guy's still alive. Get those cuffs off him, man. What the hell was that? He he made a move on me. I, I, I don't know. This is crazy. Nobody had to die. This is what happens when you give guns to assholes. He's, uh... Fucking fuck! You gotta call someone, man! What? I'm calling this in. Don't. Don't call it in yet. Just... Just wait, okay? Just give me a damn minute. Dispatch, come in. You killed that guy. You gotta deal with it, man. I just need a minute. I need a minute to think. You ain't got a minute. Shut up, you hear me? Just shut your mouth! Okay, okay, calm down. Take it easy. I'll calm down when you quit running your fucking mouth. Quit waving that thing around before you get someone else killed. Oh, you gonna get smart with me now? Vince! It's okay. Just back off. We all need to take it down a notch. You really want to pull that trigger again, son? Thanks, man. What the fuck? Did you see that? I saw it. Yeah. Hey, you gotta get us the hell out of here. You're not going anywhere. Fuck that. Get this bus moving. Hey, driver, I said let's go, we're man. We're staying right here. We're safe inside the bus. Nothing's gonna... Holy shit! Jesus. Oh my god. Hey. Hey! You need to call someone, you hear me? We need to... Did he just bail on us? Oh, Jesus. What the hell, man? Back up, back up. Fuck! 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 He can't reach us. You sure about that? That ankle's gonna get... Shit. What are we doing, guys? Come on! We gotta do something! I'm trying to think. Find a weapon. What kind of weapon? Where's the guard's gun? Yeah, yeah, the gun. Good thinking, Justin. Where the fuck is it? I think he fell on it. It was underneath it. Oh, fuck me. Get the gun, man! Get up, kids! Hurry up! Shoot this asshole, Vince! Do it! Oh! Watch it, man! Sorry. Sorry. Man, I can't believe this shit. Can you believe this shit, man? No. We gotta find some way to get out of here. Damn it. 
Whoa, whoa, watch it. Ain't gonna work. Need those keys. Where are the damn keys, man? They weren't on him. Well, shit, if the keys aren't on him, then where the hell are they? He must have left them up front. Maybe we finally caught a break. Danny, Hey, don't. buddy! What the fuck? God damn it, Danny. You always put your fucking foot fuck in. you, man. We gotta get out of here before any more of them show up. That's not gonna hold. Vince! Fire the fucking gun! I think you just pissed them off. Yeah. Yeah, save the shells. Try the chains! The chain runs through that loop that's welded to the floor. The chains are busted. How the hell are we gonna get out There's of here? There's gotta be a way. Can't we just shoot off the chains? No way. Wouldn't cut through. What about the cuff? If we shoot one of those off, the chain will slip right out. Are you fucking insane? What do you think is gonna happen if you fire a shotgun that close to someone's gun? Well, what do you think's gonna happen if we don't get the fuck out of here? Vince, give me the gun. We gotta do this. Back off! Vince! What the fuck? Whoa, whoa, whoa! Hey, I know you're a good guy. You're gonna do me and not this rapist? Sorry, buddy. No, 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 you can't! Vince, I have a family. Please. Oh! 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 oh Shit! Oh. Still attached. Again! Do it! This is so fucked! Why the hell did you shoot that guy, man? What the hell was that? I didn't mean to do it. It just happened, okay? Where the fuck were you with a warning? Me? You're putting that on me now? I didn't see the guy either. I was too worried those dudes were gonna pull guns on us. Shit! Dude, how they catch up to us? Who gives a shit? Just... Hurry up, Eddie! Here, man, shoot! Dude, take this... Get him, man! Feel that look on me, man. I'm not being an asshole. I'm being smart. No lights, no, uh, you know, they can't see us. Christ, I can taste blood in my mouth. I don't think it's mine. I guess that makes sense. Yeah, it makes sense, Wyatt. God, I can't believe we're in this shit. Don't barf just yet, okay? Please, this road is really straight. We'll be fine. At least slow down. What? Fuck no. Did you see that one guy's eyes, man? He is fucking gorked. I don't want that guy in my life, Wyatt. Dude, you are covered in that guy's blood. I know, Wyatt. My shirt is soaked. It's like, I just... Why didn't they say anything? 
Guy's taking his shit over there. That's all they had to say. Did you mean to pull the trigger? I don't know. I was so keyed up, I just... Damn it. Look, Wyatt. All I know is those guys had me all... jacked up, like I was on speed or something. I was just on edge, you know? Then I was like watching that guy's brains come out of the back of his head. Sorry, man, I... I still can't forgive you exactly. No, I get that. I don't need that, just... Whatever, dude, it's fine. Let there be light, huh? Dude, shut up. See? It's fine. Road straight as my dick. You think we're in the clear? Not till we get out of this fog. Was that a pun? No. When did you start making puns? I said no, idiot. I know. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's Tom Cruise out of here. Really? See if there's still any sticky in the glove box. I don't see anything. Dude, it's in there. Look harder. I don't see it. What I do see is that ammo that you lost last week. Oh my god, really? But is there any weed? You know, one time I was going out with this girl, right? Abigail. You remember her? And she told me that when she was five, I think, her dad took her to the circus sideshow. They walked around for a while, saw the chick with two heads, saw a dude with lobster hands, some kind of monkey human with a... Thank, loading the gun is probably more important right this second, thanks. Okay. Weird, but okay. Shit! Ah! Holy shit, dude. Holy shit. Did you get a look? I think that was a guy. Wyatt, come on, man. Say something. Was that a dude or not? What the... The fucking fog. This night is so fucked, man! I, I, I don't know. It was too fast, man. Man, don't say that! You have to know! Dude, you have to! Let's see if there's anything around the car. You know, anything that'll, like, tell us one way or the other. That way, we can just book. But I'm not leaving if we hit a human being, man. I'm just not. Man, don't roll it down broken. I can't see through the cracks. Look, it's fine, see? Dude, what's that on the broken side mirror? It's part of a shirt, I think. Yeah, but plenty of dead guys have shirts on. Keep looking. You think that blood on the windshield is fresh or rot? Is that the mirror from the car? I can't tell from here. What's that way out in the road? Does that blood look fresh to you? Yeah, but it's kind of dark. Yeah. Damn. Man, I'm really not seeing anything. Stop messing around. We need to know what's going on, okay? That's not gonna help. Okay, okay. Jeez. Look. Wyatt. It was a guy. Are you sure? Yes. How sure? Pretty fucking sure. Don't pay for sex drunk, sure. Jesus. So what do we do? What do you mean, what do we do? We go out there. Go out there and what? Find the guy and help him. Who the hell are you tonight? If it's a guy. It's a guy. I saw him. Come on, man. This is stupid. We go out there, we check it out, we get moving. Both of us? I mean, I don't know. Me? I hit the fucking guy. One of us should stay here, though, in case. Okay. 
Well, shit, okay. Here, we'll rock, paper, scissors for it. Fine. Okay, cool, good. This is good. We need to hurry up. You ready? Man, I can't believe I'm doing this shit. Dude, two seconds, it's over. All right, two out of three, right? Sure. One, two, three, go. Man. Okay. All right. One, two, three, go. Ugh. I knew you'd pick rock. You always pick rock, dude. Stupid. Son of a bitch. Careful, dude. Shoot. I tell if it belonged to our guy or not. You gotta hurry up, dude! Thing is jacked, should I take it? Great backpack if you could tell me if your owner was alive or not. All right, I guess I'll just keep talking to myself out here because that makes sense. What the fuck is taking so long? Hurry up! Hey man, you okay? Man, I wish I Fella? Right now. You need to answer me, man. If you're a dude, I don't want to shoot you. Please just say something, mister. Oh, shit. Are you okay? Uh, sir? Can you, can you hear me? Looks like he's pretty out of it. Cop, please be okay. Okay, um... Uh. Sorry, dude. Got a split.
Lady, there was a guy. I'm in trouble. Come help me out. Hey, Shell, your sister's getting pretty good, huh? Becca had a good teacher, Steph. Thank you for doing that. She needs something to focus on besides, you know, everything else. Yeah. Growing up in a world like this, what do you think that does to a kid? I'm trying to protect her from it as much as possible. Things are stable here, for now. I want her to grow up with this, not what's outside these walls. Becca's a good kid. These are shit times, and she's gonna go through that. But if we can keep her from experiencing some of the shit I've seen... Thanks, Stephanie. Thanks. Becca, that was great. Thanks, sis. You think we can do something like this every week? That sounds like a great idea. Maybe we can all get in on it, like some kind of weekly talent show. That was amazing, Becca. We could all use a little more music in our lives. Did I ever tell you that I used to play in a band? Yes, Roman, you've told us. She doesn't want to hear about it again. All right, all right. In that case, let's get back to work. Oh, and thanks to Boyd's hard work on the vegetable garden, we're having fresh soup tonight. Okay, let's get to it. You want to help me and Shell do the supply inspection? Cool. You check the flashlights this time. I'll look over the guns. Okay, but be careful. People's lives depend on those. We can't have them screwing up because we got late. Shell, when you get a sec, meet me out back. Help me feed the watchdogs. Sure thing. How are we doing on ammo? Better than we thought. We haven't had to use these for a while. What did Roman want? I don't know yet. Are you gonna find out? Yeah, in a sec. Huh. Still one short. We never found the other flashlight? Nope. Still in the cornfield somewhere, I guess. Hungry. I guess he knows it's feeding time. It's disgusting. Can't disagree with you there. You know, uh, your sister said she wouldn't mind doing this. Roman, we've talked about this. Becca doesn't need to deal with this kind of thing. Listen, I know you think that giving her an easy life is what's best, but it's really not. This is far from an easy life, Roman. You know what I mean. 
She needs to know the sacrifices we have to make to survive in this world. As long as she knows how to protect herself, it's fine. I don't want her to stop caring about people. Okay. What's that one eating? I don't know. I'll check it out. I gotta get back out front. Looking forward to that suit. Problem. I do this all the time. You don't get all pissed off. I'm sorry. It's it's just the watchdogs. I guess they found a, a puppy. A puppy? Yeah. I guess it just got to me. You know, it was it was so little. You don't think about babies anymore, but after a while you just kind of accept this is it. Yeah, I guess you kind of forget. <laughs> right. But then, you know, there it is. You see it and you want to protect it and... and now it's gone. That sucks. Maybe if Clive dies next, we can put him out there instead. He'd make a better watchdog anyway. Becca. Shell, Becca! Something's going on outside. What is it? I don't know. Something bad. We gotta find Roman. Come here, everyone. Shit. Come on. We gotta find Roman. Miss Mom. It's so okay to be here. Jeez. Largum. My God, Largum. what did you do? All I did was put on the blindfold and bind his wrists. Somebody else beat him up. He already had the cuts and bruises. Watchdogs caught him trying to steal supplies. Is he bitten? No, they didn't get that close. What did he take? Food, medicine, whatever he could get his hands on. Usual stuff. I couldn't get any other information out of him. I don't think he speaks English. I can't believe he just snuck it's in. the second break-in we've had in the last couple of weeks. Last time we couldn't catch him. And they got away with more medicine than we could afford to lose. Well, we all know what it's like trying to survive out there. He just came in here for food. Let's just give him some and send him on but his way. what if there are more of them? He could have been scouting. That's right. He could be part of a larger group. If there were more, I think we would have seen them by now. I mean, nobody travels alone by choice anymore, right? We can't just let him go. It's too dangerous. Who knows if he has friends waiting to attack? Don't you think we would have seen someone by now? At least trying to negotiate to get him back. You don't know that. It does make sense, though. Well, he's not staying here. You let in a stranger, and everything starts breaking down. The last time we did that, we lost three. And then Vernon with that goddamn boat. Vernon and the boat are the reason the group fell apart. Not trusting strangers. We stole their boat from that teenage kid at gunpoint. That's when our group fell apart. He can't stay here. I agree. Keeping him here is not an option. In his condition, he'd be a drain on our resources. Look, we all know what we're talking about here, so let's stop dancing around it. We either let this guy go and take our chances, or we kill him. Jesus Christ, are you serious? Roman's right. It's gotta be one or the other. We're letting him go. It's the only right thing to do. I'm telling you, we can't do that. But killing him? Is that really the answer? Stephanie. Boyd, you two don't think we should kill him. We know where Joyce and Clive stand on the subject. 
You're the swing vote here, Shell. What's it gonna be? We have to set him free. We can't. He's not even armed. We can't just kill him. This isn't in self-defense. Isn't it, though? If it means he can't come back to hurt us? That isn't the same thing. But last time... Joyce, that was a long time ago. If we kill this man, then we're giving up a part of ourselves that we can never get back. I'm not ready to let that go. Cut him free. I hope you guys know what you're doing. Oh, Give him some food. When, three or four cans. Just as a gesture of good faith. And get him out of here. I don't know if you can understand a word I'm saying. But you better understand this. You came this close to death today. And if you ever, ever come near this place again. Or tell anybody where we are. You wish you had died today. Do you have any fours? Nope. Do you have any sevens? Go fish. I miss playing guitar for everyone. It was stupid, but fun. Why don't we do that? Since the attack, there's a lot we don't do anymore. I shouldn't have let that guy go. Boyd would still be alive, and everything would be the same. Boyd agreed it was the right thing to do. Anyway, Roman's obsessed with keeping this place secured now. You know that's impossible, right? Well, after last time, Roman isn't taking any chances. Then he should fix the loose board behind the storage lots. Becca, are you sneaking out again? Oh, God, do you know how dangerous that is? It's not dangerous. There's nothing out there but slow-ass walkers. What are you talking about? We've had two break-ins already. Anyone could be out there. What if someone sees you and, and follows you? They won't. Damn it, Becca. Shell, I need to talk to you. It's open. What's going on? Hey, Becca. Hey. When you, uh, get a sec, I need you to come out and talk to me. It's important. Okay. I'll be outside. You'll see me. Give us a minute. Yeah. Just don't take too long. What was that all about? I don't know. Probably not good, though. Stay here. It'll be just a minute. I'll fill you in when I get back. Roman? Good, you're here. What's this all about? It's Stephanie. What oh. happened? We caught her trying to escape. Maybe she wasn't. Maybe she just wanted to get outside these walls for a while. Ever since the incident, you've made this place feel, I don't know, oppressive. We've made it safe. She was definitely trying to escape. She had most of our ammo and medicine with her. She screwed us, Shell. All of us. And now we're in that position again where we can't keep her here and we can't let her go. You do know why I'm telling you this, right? Yeah. You want me to take... 
You and Boyd were the ones who fought to let that guy go. Convinced us all to take that chance. But we did. And it was wrong. And now Boyd is dead. We're beyond the luxury of taking chances now. And I need to know that you're with us 100%. I'll do it. I don't really have a choice, do I? You got your gun? It's in the camper. I'll give you a few minutes to get your head together. God, what do I tell Becca? That's up to you. Whatever you say, I'll back you up. Shell? What's wrong? Am I in trouble? It's Stephanie. She stole a bunch of supplies and tried to escape. Oh my god. What the hell did she do that for? Roman says we have to... Kill her? Yeah. Why would she do this to us? She's just scared. She made a mistake. That'll be our last mistake. Becca, Stephanie is your friend. Was my friend. Roman wants me to do it. I'm sorry. Let's just get it over with. Your gun's over there, in the drawer. I don't want this to be who we are. Just let me do it then. No, I'll do it. You shouldn't ever have to do something like this. I just need a second. This really sucks. Yeah, it does. You know, we don't have to do this. We can just go. What? We've survived on our own before. If we just go, we can be out of here before anyone can do anything about it. Are you crazy? Where would we go? There's nothing out there. As long as we're here, we're safe. The group will protect us. But for how long? I don't know. Longer than we'd survive out there. Besides, you know the rules. If we try to leave, Roman will hunt us down. We don't have a choice. This is who we are now. Shell. Time. Roman's waiting. Why are you just standing there? I don't ever want to put you in danger. If that means this is what we have to become, then it is what it is. Sorry. Me too.
Mm-hmm. Hey, you getting up? Good. I see you cuddling with your girlfriend down there. Shit, bro. I don't want no trouble. Please. You just want to be left alone with your friend down there? No, just leave me alone. Look, I don't care what you do to whatever corpse you find. I wasn't. What's your name? Rocky. So you didn't steal that bag. I don't care who you steal from, if you did. Maybe you're in a gang that likes to rob people. I don't know. Are you in a crew? You got some boys wearing hoodies I gotta worry about? Because you steal from me and I'll get your throat out. I don't care who you run around with, you understand? It's mine. I didn't steal it. All right, good. I don't like these. Just get in the car. You're gonna get eaten out here otherwise and I'm bored. Come on, scoop. Ain't gonna wait forever. You take me to Statesboro? I'm trying to get to my grand's house. Fuck, she like to party? Just get in, we'll get there. Or somewhere, eventually. Come on, bro. What up, Marcus? Name's Nate. Alright, bro, be careful. Thanks for asking. You thirsty? Uh. Here you go. I'm straight, thanks. You're not uptight, are you? Is this the fucking apocalypse? This is like nothing. No, I'm just good, all right? All right, all right. You want to tell me about where you come from, at least? You must have been with a crew. Any tailback where you come from? Maybe drop you off and do a double back. No, uh, tail. Damn. I retract my question. There was a girl who I liked, all right. You argue in semantics, Russ. Give a pal the deets. All right. There was seven of us. I didn't have any family there or nothing. They're all my grandson, Statesboro. There was a dad who had a daughter about my age. One guy said he used to be a cop, but nobody really believed him. Then a teacher and his wife. The leader was this guy. Steve. Go back to the daughter. Steve was a bad dude, but everybody was with him, you know? He said seven was the magic number, so we didn't add nobody to the group. We found survivors. It was the same every time. He... He... Let it out, Paco. Just... We gonna kill these folks and take this stuff or what? Then bang! They'd be dead. Anyway... I couldn't handle that. For weeks of it, I packed my shit up and figured I could make my grands alone and try to find my family. I slipped out of there. I couldn't live like that. So nobody got down with the daughter then? No, they didn't. Who was you give her? Strong six. Just tell me something about her. How was the rat? Give me a little something. Just a taste. Russ, I'm doing you a service here. I gotta get my beak wet. I put it right in here. You're fucking rude, man. Oh, you're Miss Manners, that it? Let's try again. All right, maybe someone who wasn't so near and dear to your heart then. What the fuck? Come on, scale of one to ten. What do you think? Ah, slamming before she was dropped, right? What do you think? 
Let's look for some supplies in here. See if we can fill up while we're at it. Don't be mad. Fine, be mad. Just stop being a pussy. All right. Oh shit, go! Russ, get the fuck down, man! You don't want to be there! Get to the truck, I'll cover you! Okay, get ready! Don't stop, stop running. running! And keep your head down! Good huh? What happened to- I'll cover you! Look how good you did. I don't know, man. Fuck, I'm screwed. You haven't been shot in three months? Come on, kid, look at me. No big deal. We got this, okay? Okay. First, we're gonna figure out exactly where this asshole is. Just get a quick glance. Down! See? Easy. Now we know where he is, we can fucking get him. All right. Okay. That's the spirit. Let's push this truck for cover. Okay. It's in neutral. Just keep your head down. Side of the building. We gotta go from cover to cover. Seriously, this time. I'm not fucking around. You gonna cover me? If we get to that car, we'll be out of the line of fire. Here. You can cover me first. I'm not fucking around. You cover me, then I'll cover you. Or if you want to go first, that's fine too. I'll cover you. You go first. Just shoot the window and keep that fucker's head down until I get where I'm going. Throw me the gun, and I'll do this. Ready? Yeah. You ready, Russ? Cover my ass now. Remember, don't stop shooting. Fire! Over, we're gonna take what we can, head on down to your grams, and have a big old home cooked meal, all right? Come on, watch out for that. 
was the problem. No, no problem. Then come on. Russ, come on. I think I saw oh, God. No shit. Grab him. I'll cover you. Do I sneak up? Just jump out, grab him. You're gone. Fucking move! What? Oh! Get the fuck out of here, you monsters! Whoa, Gramps! I told you not to come back here. Think you can just leave your mask at home? And now you're what? with this fucking spunk. First off, watch the fucking racism. This is my boy. Secondly, I don't fucking know you. We were just passing by like anyone else. Bullshit! You came back to finish us off and take all our food! You've lost your goddamn marbles. She's dying, and now she can see your face. Max, what's he talking about? Fuck it, I know. He's crazy. Have you been here before? Russell, don't you start. You tried to kill us for no goddamn reason. If anything, we should take you out for that. Please, just get the fuck out of here! Please leave us alone! What do you say, Russ? Should we just kill these folks and take all their stuff? Are you serious? Maybe. Why not? That's fucked up! There are real fucking monsters out there! No shit. And you're just gonna joke about the shit I see! Fuck you, Nate! I saved your ass. You didn't do shit. Easy, Russ. I'm not hurting no one. And don't you hurt these people either. Come on. Can we still be friends? No. Okay, we got one. A snake for a tongue. You are so bad at this. Would you rather have a snake for a tongue? Awful. Or lobster claws for hands? <laughs> are the claws lobster size or human? Human size? Can make this easy, honey. Well, I'm thinking. Think harder. And how exactly do you think harder? Snake tongue. Gross. What? How is that more gross than lobster hands? Well, for one, it's in your mouth. Hey, you asked the question, Hoss. Okay, uh, how about... Oh, never mind. I probably ought to stop bugging you with stupid hypotheticals. Oh, come on. You'd be a lot less fun. You've been a lot more fun lately. Feeling better? I guess I am. Well, you sure do look better. So, uh, 
You gotta admit, anything is an improvement. That came out wrong. Uh, what I mean is... I mean, uh, you were... You were, uh... You know. You know, you're, no, you're not, not perfect, perfect either, either, Mr. Lobster Hands. Hands. Maybe I should spend a minute listening up your walls. See how you like it. Me? I ain't perfect. That's right. And you're older than dirt. Look, as long as you stay off that stuff, you can have all the flaws you want. I mean it, though. After we found you, you were still so hooked on that stuff. I never thought you'd make it. You ain't out of the woods yet, I know, but... Well, you've come a long way, Bonnie. And I'm proud of you. You're a good friend, Leland. I know. Okay, you're not that great. Look, you know I ain't going nowhere, right? As long as we're together, I'll be there for you. You ain't gotta worry. You know that, right? I know. God, Leland. Thank you. Bonnie. Leland? Bonnie? Dee. Hey, honey. I found us something. What are you two up to? Just chatting. Chatting, huh? What about? Oh, um, well, um, lobsters. Lobsters. Well, fish. Figured it'd be worth a shot. For the food, you know. Leland, you, you hate, hate fishing. fishing. That ain't totally true. And how many days you gone fishing? What? I go fishing all the time. Thought you didn't. I am a catch. Don't I know it. I got you a present. Oh, you shouldn't have. What'd you find? I'll tell you later. I don't mean to interrupt a chat with your uh, girlfriend, but uh, we gotta get moving. Does she think we... So, where'd you get the bag, D? D? D, did you hear me? Keep up the pace, you two. What's in the bag, D? I told you, it's a surprise. Hey, D, when we get back to camp, would you let me borrow some of that nail polish? Sure, honey, you like this color? It's my favorite. And after today, I could use a new coat, you know? Same here. I feel like a brown rat with these claws. Not to interrupt the girl talk here, but to be that bad. Look, I found it down the road a piece, all right? Where down the road? Some place off that way. Damn it, Dee, you gotta give us more than that. Did you steal it? What? Dee, Bonnie's right. If you stole that bag, we need to know. You don't gotta make no big deal out of it. You guys sure gang up on me a lot lately. Honey, that ain't true. Tell me one time you sided with me in the last week. The last month. All right. Remember one especially, but I know I have. Boss, this is how all our fights go. Every time. Now we're standing here in the woods, soaking through, and for what? Don't you want to get to the camp before dark? I ain't the one. ain't helping anything. But you are the one who made me stop. Here regardless, we can just as easy carry on like this while we're walking. Oh, I've about had it with that attitude. Attitude? Now we're standing in this goddamn rain in this... Goddamn middle of nowhere place. You listen to me now. I have had it up to here with listening to you. I can't believe you. Oh, forget the both of you. I'm leaving. Don't leave, please. We can sort this out. Lord, give me strength. We'll straighten this out. We will. Right, D? We we can solve this out. We just need to get somewhere else. Oh, now you agree with me. Bye, darling. I'm sorry we're dying. D, come on. Say it. I know what side your bread and butter on. Yours, too. D, now's not the time. Whatever issues we got, I'll hash them out later. It's always later. What are you saying? You know exactly what I'm saying. Well, come on now, D. No reason to pick a fight. I'm sorry. I just want to get somewhere where I can change my clothes, and then you and your girlfriend can... Oh, no. Oh, God, run. Come on, we gotta move. What are you talking about? Oh, shit. We gotta run, gotta run, gotta go, gotta go. Oh, she got shot.
Oh snap. Come on. See anything? Where the hell are they? Shit. Where, Where are, are you? Anybody oh. see anything? Oh. Anything? No, I can't see a damn thing out here. Okay, Bonnie. Stay calm. Find a oh, weapon. You did this. Oh, God, you, you killed, killed me. me. You, you killed me. me. Anybody see anything? I should it's never dark out here. trusted you. Just, <laughs> just joking. I, God, I'm so sorry. So, I can't. Oh, God. I knew you'd fuck up again. Take him. I, I, no, God, I'm sorry, I need him, I need you both. Thank you. 
thing to say to her. I'm sorry, Dee. I really, truly am. She loved you, bye. I'm sorry to do this to you, darling. Leave you here. This way. We can't stay here forever. I think I saw something over here. Die for this thing, I for damn sure ain't leaving it behind. Around five, I think. They left a note, so at least we know they won't be found. And I can see smoke in the distance. Probably a camp. I'm gonna try to make contact tonight. Great. Well, just be careful and use your best judgment. We're building a good community here, we want to keep it that way. Of course. My name is Tavia. How did you find us? I found your note. I'm a scout for a growing settlement up north. We go out and look for survivors to rescue them. We have food, clean water, and shelter for everyone. We're offering you a chance to help us out and start over. God, this sounds too good to be true, but I think it is. Buddy, get real. Just because she says it's true doesn't mean you should know about that. At least what I did was an accident. Hey, that's enough. Guys, look. If I learned one thing from Danny, it's that we have to stick together and protect ourselves. What? That guy was an asshole. You should be happy he got killed before Shell and Becca joined us. Why? Don't worry about it. Yeah, screw this. We don't know what kind of people we're dealing with. The only reason I'm with you guys is because Vince saved my life. Look, we need people, plain and simple. And you folks can decide if you want to come as a group or split up or whatever. But I don't want to be out here in the open after dark. So in a few minutes, I'm going to be getting back in my car and on my way. Hopefully, at least some of you will follow me. Chell, why are we even listening to her? She's obvious. Even if she's not, I think it's better to just keep on the move. Staying in one place makes you an easy target. I don't care how safe you think it is. That truck stop was a death trap. It was right off the highway, for God's sake. No way you and a bunch of sick old people were going to defend it. I don't like this, guys. We should just walk away. I don't trust her. Of course you don't, Russell. You don't trust anyone. Then stay here if you want. I'm not bringing anyone against their will. We only want people who want to be there. Oh, come on, guys. I mean, we left those photos so that someone could find us, didn't we? Well, it could be a trap. What if they were- Thank you. Everyone out there is batshit crazy. We've all seen it. Well, we turned out all right, didn't we? Relatively speaking. If we wanted to kill you, you'd be dead already. I had a gun and snuck right up. Well, what's stopping you? Exactly. Nothing. Look, I know you guys are wary, and you have every right to be. 
You don't know me from a hole in the ground. And yet, there are some crazy fuckers out there. All I'm here to do is make an offer. You can come with me, or you can stay here. The choice is yours. So, who wants to come with me? I'm just not sure. We've been out here for so long and seen so much bullshit. I mean, is it really worth getting our hopes up? Of course it is, Russell. Hope is all we've got left. But being smart, that's what's keeping us alive. It's your choice. Again, I'm not trying to force you or convince you. As long as you're willing to obey the rules and pull your weight, you're welcome to come. But you've got to decide now. We're not going to be out this way again for a long time. We understand. I think we've all made up our minds. Well, I guess we have our group. What do you want to do with these? This is a good thing. I know it is. How do we know this will work out? I give you my word. <laughs> and then we shoot everybody and then take their resources. Huh? I'm stop. <laughs> Please. Hmm. Did I only one person went? 